and welcome to Cooker episode number, I don't really know, but this is a Christmas thing that we all, that I never tried before, I'm going to try this and see how it turns out and then stuff, um, so it is eggnog. If you guys like eggnog, give it a big thumbs up. If you guys don't, that's alright, so, but today we're going to cook and make eggnog. Yeah, eggnog is awesome. So let's get started. Okay, the greens that you would need are sugar, nutmeg, two eggs, measure no milk and vanilla, and whole cloves. Which if you guys don't know what cloves are, these are the cloves I found that out. So that's what I'm doing. The tools that would you need will be measure cups. Teaspoons or tablespoons, it doesn't matter which one you guys use. If you guys use tablespoons, I would tell you guys in the video. And blender. Will it blend? That is a question. Let's find out, will it blend? So the first thing first is get two eggs and crack in the bowl. So after when you're done beating the eggs, you put the egg in the blender. Then you put three tablespoons of sugar, which I'm using there so it's easier and I don't have to measure exactly. Three. Then you need milk, which is one I mean two cups and one third. So I have milk here so you guys can see. One second I just have to open because it's a new cotton. So one cup. A two cup. And two cups and a third. One third cups of milk. Three cups. Then you want one teaspoon, I mean, yeah, teaspoon of vanilla. So there's one. Then you put some whole cloves into it. You need at least some, not too much. Probably a pinch or four, it doesn't really matter how many you put in. But that makes it a little bit more um, spicy and them stuff. That was, on, that was actually on a plate, so. And I know on the plate, some reason I have a plate underneath that. Then you dash some nutmeg. Oops. Way too much. But that's alright. Cinnamon is good. I mean, nutmeg's good, not cinnamon, what am I talking about? Nutmeg and cinnamon are tasty. Exact same thing, but a little bit different, so... And then, once you've done that, it's blender time! Then let it set for... 10 minutes at least, so I'm going to put my time on and be right back after 10 minutes. A few moments later. After 10 minutes later, um, this is what it looks like. It looks so good. You can burn the fridge for a little bit more, it doesn't really matter, but it's up to you when you want to drink it. It will have bubbles on top, but... Tastes really, really good. Tastes like real thing. Woo! Eggnog is good. You guys can add rum to this if you guys like. It's up to you guys. I recommend not to add rum, but that's up to you. You guys can add any alcohol drink in there. It's up to you guys. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you guys do, give it a big thumbs up. If you guys do, um, happy Christmas holidays to you guys. So, joking and sending it. Peace out, guys. See you guys back here in New Year. New Year. 
It's pretty ne pretty new New Year's Eve, and it, it's pretty awesome you guys do it. So, John, we're gonna send it. Peace out, guys. See you guys back in a new feature. Have a good day. Goodbye, and have a good Christmas. If you guys have a, a if you guys celebrate Christmas, Holocaust, I don't really care what you guys celebrate. Have a good slow day. Have a good holiday. Spend time with the family as much as you can because let me know when something's gonna happen. I don't know. Anything could happen. Never know. So spend time as much as your family, as much as we do. I do. So have a good day. Bye!